You guys loved my last video and I loved all your support in it because I wasn't even expecting it. It was just a suggestion from my friend. So like, so the fact that you guys can relate to it and really enjoyed it, it was, it's very like amazing to me. So thank you guys like so much, honestly. Um, so based off that, I thought I should do like a video about being employed, looking for employment and dealing with the stress of being um, unemployed. Because first of all, looking for a job is not easy at all. Like it's so stressful and it's so hard and it's some it really gets a lot of people down to be honest. I had a really close friend. Oh my god. That's very close. I won't say what type of friend because it, you guys would figure it out. But she just wasn't a happy bunny at one period in life when she didn't have a job. If she wanted to be just gonna laugh. And every single time she just kept on going on about how she's unemployed and oh, it was so annoying and it really made her depressed to be honest. And it's not nice seeing that because it can do that. And like when you're applying and applying and applying and you're not even getting responses, I feel like at least jobs should have the courtesy of at least telling you when you didn't get the job because a lot of them don't. And I was really shocked, right, because my best friend works for Zara and actually I've never really had to see anyone's CVs but she said a lot of the time that when people are handing their CVs a lot of the time they would throw them in the bin and I was like, oh, didn't know that I heard it happens but I didn't know it actually happens so like you just need to be aware uh, and another thing I don't really agree with to be honest is um sites that you enter your cv through and apply and apply multiple times it's never ever never ever worked for me or worked for like a few people that i know to be honest i feel like it's better just to contact jobs directly and funny enough gumtree is amazing for jobs like absolutely amazing i found so many jobs on there to be honest if you want immediate employment go for jobs on there and sometimes don't always think about the field that you want to be in sometimes you might just have to think about another field another sector and then keep applying while you're in that sector and you're getting yourself money and you're paying your bills and stuff at least don't, don't stop applying because I feel like even if you don't enjoy a job you can just get too comfortable with the fact that you have got a job and then you just tend to forget to not to still keep that process of applying for other jobs like it's so easy to get comfortable in employment and just to stop applying like but i still feel like you should continuously apply even if you are in a job until you can get to the place where you want to get to job wise and dealing with the stress of it i just feel like the only way you can deal with the stress of employment is really getting yourself out there and doing something that you don't particularly like so like maybe look at other sectors like i said especially go to like agencies and stuff and Agency is probably the fastest way to get into any sort of employment, but you have you can't be so picky about jobs. Like if you want a job and you're looking for a job, then you have to literally be willing to do anything. And I'm not trying to say that you should be. Maybe you should be a bin cleaner. Maybe you should be a cleaner. Or maybe you should work in a warehouse. Or maybe you should work in hospitality. Or maybe you should be a waiter or a waitress. It might not might not be something that you want to do. Even if it is something, just don't be so fussy because nothing is forever and as long as you can pay and do what you need to do and besides it keeps your head productive as well keeps you busy, working and yeah just don't stop applying nothing's forever so even if you are applying maybe you need to change up your tactic change up what you're applying for and how you're applying um, and where you're applying as well yeah like look at yourself as an employer like do you think you're employed do you think your cv is employable you know just think of stuff like that me i feel like people always put, make their articulate their cv so well and i'm like to be honest i feel like it's better to put i think less is more minimal stuff on your cv and to like approach it like you're a person they're talking to that's what's worked for me instead of doing the the I'm hard working, my goals are yeah, yeah, yeah. I work it's like oh, you know you need to chop up and cut off some of that nonsense. Not any time no one wants to keep reading your dictionary. You know, less is more short and sweet and 
leaving you to want more so you have to take some information out and if they and certain stuff you can be like with me i don't put my references if you want to know more then if you invite me for an interview i'll be happy to provide my references i need to be providing people's contact details every single way so you can just put my stuff in the bin now uh because -uh, i'm not wasting time writing a long cv if you're not even going to read it that's why i said less is more saves time for you saves time for the employer reading to us so yeah that was a quick video about that um and yeah <laughs> i don't know what else to say about that but i hope it helps because the other one seemed to help and a lot of people seem to relate to it so i feel like this is a good um follow up to that video and I hope you enjoy it and I really do, do hope that it helps someone and remember if anything you guys you want to ask, you want to know, put it down in the comments, go in my, all my social media, you can message me on Instagram, you can message me on Snapchat, I'm having a bit of trouble with my Facebook to be honest, I haven't been on there for a long time, I think someone's hacked it but I don't really care. Um, yeah, we're at wet like sweat, no spaces. And you can email me, junior.joy, J-O-Y-E, at gmail.com. And anything you want to ask me, anything you want to say, just make sure you send it. Um, and I'm going now because I feel like I need to rest. My mouth is starting to tighten. So, mwah! Take care, you guys, and stay blessed and have a beautiful day.